Good morning guys and happy Wednesday. Sorry about my voice this morning. I think I've actually woke up feeling a little bit ill um, and also realized that I'm in the same jumper and have the same hat as yesterday. But I slept in my plaits and I've just worked on the same jumper because it was by my bed. But we're still in Warwick um, and we've got another day being really productive. We're gonna head off to um, the Gymshark Lifting Club in probably about an hour or something. I'm just letting my video, which will go out today, export. But I thought I'd start filming another video um, because why not? And I thought I'd make it like a what I eat in a day. I'm trying to start going into a little bit of a calorie deficit just because I'm holding quite a lot of like extra body fat at the moment, which is absolutely fine. I always have times of the year where I'm a bit like this, but I'm trying to reduce what I'm eating just a little bit. And naturally I'm doing more gym sessions in a week now just because I was really, really inconsistent for ages. And like this week I've been every day. Um, and I went on Sunday as well. So I'm doing quite well with that so far. Probably gonna hit up a bit of a back session, do loads of filming in the gym. But I'm gonna start with breakfast and show you what I'm making. Did, um... Okay, so these actually look like the worst poached eggs I've ever, ever made. I'm usually quite good at poached eggs, aren't I? Not good at poached eggs. I am. I taught earlier how to make poached eggs. As a lie. Oh, wait, no, we always have this debate. Charlie Rigo taught me how to make poached eggs. Okay, I didn't teach him how to make poached eggs. Anyway, I don't know what has happened here, but um, they'll taste nice anyway. And I'm having a whole bagel. I try and get in quite a lot of carbs before I go to the gym, especially if I'm trying to eat and... A little bit of a calorie deficit just because that's when I need the energy because I get really dizzy otherwise. And then this is filled up with water. This is my corkscrew bottle, by the way, which is the Keith Haring um, collaboration. And I think it's literally the coolest bottle ever. So this has just got water in. I'm gonna enjoy that. This is actually what my stomach looks like before I'm going to film, which is really nice for me. And yeah, it's just really painful. I'm completely rock solid, feel it. This is literally rock solid. Mental. So we just got to the gym and my blazing's gone down a little bit. But like, it's still very much there. So I'm kind of contemplating just filming in a t-shirt today. It feels good to be home though. Yeah. Remember I used to record off my s -bars. It's like a freshman here back in the days. Yeah, so every day when I wake up, now the first thing I do is go check my plays. Because I appreciate every fan, every like, every share, and every listen. And these rappers that are quote better than me, well why call it a game if there ain't no competition? Yeah, so every day I be working. Futuristic sound to flow tight like a virgin, uh, yeah. These dudes never used to hit me bad. Now to do the feature, bruh, it's 200 for the track. Not cocky, just deserve some respect. You mistook if you're not concerned that yeah, I'm a threat. If you sick, dog, then make me the vet. But don't get it twisted, I'm the illest as a guest, bruh. Hey, Yeah, yeah. Said I come up for the game, said I come up for the fame. 
I'm undercover right now Like your girl the other day But I know it's gonna change I've been learning my lessons It's my second year But I'm about to make my first impression Got me through the headphones And give me your attention I've been fucking the game Not wearing no protection Right? And you know what it is Been dropping hits after hits Man, you know that kid will never miss Feeling the flow And they know that it go Living my life Trying to live it some more Been doing the numbers From nothing to something I've been getting plays You've been played by them hoes Running this shit when I come into your town Thinking on another level while they sticking to the ground And everybody asking when another track about to drop They used to never pay attention Now they pay until I stop, it's like that I don't pay attention, but honestly I don't mind Cause it's hot So back from the gym, um, and we just had a ginger biscuit each. Why two actually? I didn't mean to have one. I actually forgot that I was trying to eat in a calorie deficit today. Nip, These nip. like all butter ginger biscuits, um, but they're really good. So it's fine, and it's post workout. Exactly. Post workout carbs. Um, but I'm gonna make us lunch, and we went shopping on the first day we got here, and I think the plan for today was like a tomato pasta. Thing. Is it? Yeah. What? what did you want? I don't know. I thought I was thinking more like a pad thai or something. For lunch? What? I could do pad thai for lunch. Yeah. And then a protein. But I did make pad thai for us basically a few days ago, but you didn't like the fish sauce, did you? It just makes me feel sick. Can everyone vouch for me that fish sauce is like a normal ingredient? For pad thai, no, I know. I know it's meant to be a normal ingredient, but the smell, honestly, just it ruins. I'll just put bit. last of it in. Yeah. Um, but yeah, pad thai would be great. Okay, but then we are having something more simple for dinner. Yeah, but what's, what do you mean tomato pasta? Where's the, where's the team? We got, well you can have chicken in it. What, what team are you having? Team. <laughs> Elliot calls protein team. It makes um, sense. I don't know, none. Great. But I could have chicken. Mm. Anyway, we don't need to have this conversation in my vlog. Um, so yeah, okay, I'll make us a pad thai now then. Sounds like a plan. Okay, that sounds great. I just thought I'd give you like a mini tour. Oh wait, we've not opened the blind, the curtains today. It's actually so light in here though because they've got little Velux windows. It's such a cute place and that's the farm. Oh, you can't even see it behind but I'm sure we'll go for a little coffee later. Um, so yeah, this is the workstation which is a bit messy because we've got work stuff everywhere. This is the kitchen. This is Elliot's workstation for the day. We need to open those blinds as well. Um, we've got a little L-shaped sofa, television, and then a bedroom. It's just everything we need, basically. And a little bathroom in here. It's just perfect. You did, you did good, Elliot. I did. You did real good. I just want to show you the ginger cookies quickly because if you shop at what, Lidl, not Aldi, yeah, yeah, if you shop at Lidl, these They're stem... the nuts, mate. <laughs> They're the nuts. They're the nuts. That's not a saying. Well, it is a saying. They're the bee's knees. No. They're the bee's knees. Um, these are really good. All better stem ginger cookies. Mm. Right, so we've just had a complete change of plan with dinner because I've just realised that we ate all the noodles the other day and we haven't bought any more. So we're going to have pasta because we've got some of that left. With the chicken in for Elliot, I probably won't have any. Some pasta sauce. We're not going to make it from scratch because we, we're trying not to buy too many ingredients. Um, but then I'll add in garlic, a shallot, broccoli, peppers, <laughs> what did you say? Shlot. <laughs> it is called a shlot. Oh, it's, it's not a normal onion. Um, and maybe a bit of chilli as well. Just try and like spice it up a bit, you know? Um, so yeah, I'm going to get cracking with that and then we probably need to go shopping again for dinner because we've realised that we don't have any food. <laughs>
was about to say do a taste test, but you threw it on the table instead. Ooh, the suspense. Mm. Does mm. it taste like Domino pasta sauce on pasta? It tastes good. Good. Just having a chill, bit of chill Don't time. Right, come on, little old fogey, let's go on a walk. Walk to the cafe, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not right, so we're just going on a little walk. Well, basically to the farm cafe thing, um, just to get out the apartment, I guess, for a bit. Because we seem to have been in there for like, I don't know. We basically been working until about half eleven at night, then going straight to bed, getting up and doing work again. Um, so we're just having a little bit of fresh air, and there's some cute animals as well. So maybe we'll go and visit them. Or some piggies. Oh, what are you doing in the in the mud pit? Oh my god, she's the biggest pig. Can you zoom in on this camera? Oh my god, this is so funny. Wait, is it pregnant? It does look a bit pregnant though. Similar vibes, hey? <laughs> Oat milk, decaf coffee. Bing! What have you got? Man's just got tea in there. <laughs> You're so street these days. Right, so it's dinner time and we didn't actually make it to the shops. So I'm basically going to be making dinner um, from whatever we've got left in the cupboard. So we figured out that we have tuna, two tins of tuna. We've got some mayonnaise. We've got half a tin of sweet corn left over. Um, so I'm basically going to be making pasta from that. Um, pasta? A pasta dish with that. Um, and we actually only have tagliatelle. Oh. So we have tagliatelle tuna pasta? Yeah. Sick. Basically. So this is the pasta we'll be using for this, which is all a bit weird. But it seems such a shame to waste food when we're going tomorrow. Well, we wouldn't be wasting it, but you know, to go and buy new food when we don't need it. So it's a bit of a random dinner, to be honest. I kind of wanted to make a nice recipe, but oh well. So my goal is, because I've been training really hard this week, to get in a lot of protein, and tuna's obviously really good for that, because it's just a really, really easy source of protein. Like, I eat it quite a lot, to be honest. I know it's not the best, like, obviously, in an ideal world, I'd be buying, like, tuna steaks, but that's just not really realistic. And it's also quite affordable, so it's just a winner. dinner ever right guys we're gonna eat our really simple tuna pasta um and just watch a bit of tv we're watching this really weird thing about these people that go into a jail and they're not actually convicts or whatever so we're gonna watch a bit of that on netflix and just chill because we've literally not chilled since we got here so we're gonna finish eating dinner and end the video there sorry the last meal was a little bit rubbish but i promise in the next oh my god would that be watch Something just flew down there. Anyway, but I promise in the... <laughs> I think it was. A bee? <laughs> Shh, let me end the Enjoy. video. But I promise in the next What I Eat in a video, it'll be full of really good recipes because I know I said that in the last one as well. But leave a comment if you want to see more of these types of videos and give the video a like and I'll see you in the next one.
be against the world I've been doing what I really love Haters been hiding behind the screen Man, they movie cuts And when I'm back at home It never feels the same Cause we've been doing our own thing Trying to stay up I wanna go back